Hi, I'm John Storms, and today I'm just going to show you a quick trick so that you can easily get a listing of all of your channels. Uh, let's see, so I was going to start by kicking off the control panel here. Okay, get Lightarama running, open up the sequence editor. And why would you want to have a list of channels? Well, you might want to have a checklist so you can, you know, see if you've installed everything, converted everything, modeled everything. Uh, see if you have if you've skipped any channels. There's all sorts of reasons why you might want to do it. So what you do is you open up just your favorite sequence. Uh, let's see. I'm going to try to open something with not quite so many channels. Here we go. It doesn't matter what it is. And you could actually, and what we're going to do is we're going to open up this, this stuff in Excel. And you could actually open up one of your sequence files directly, but it comes with all this extraneous channel information and it gets a little noisy. So what you do is you come up to Edit, go to Export, Channel Configuration, and we just call it something like Erase Me. And we'll save that as Erase Me LCC. Okay. So I close this, and then I open up Excel. Okay, uh, let's see. I want to open a workbook, and so you go to where you saved it, which in this case was in my sequences directory. So you go to where your Lightroom is set to store your sequences, and I say all files. Okay, and here it is. Erase me LCC. Now Lightroom stores its files in. Um, XML formatted text files with this LCC extension. I click on open. Okay, and it says it doesn't know it doesn't know the extension. I say, yep, I want to keep on going. And then it gives you the option. It says open XML. It says, how do you want to do it? So you open it up as a XML table. Okay. And here it is. <coughs> This first column is just a file version that is uh, pretty much useless. This is the name of your channel. Color is the color that you actually have it uh, set to um, in your sequence editor. Like I, 255 is red, this is green, and so on. What type of device it is. So these are Lightarama channels. These are ones that uh, have no device type. And then I think I have some DMX stuff here. This is DMX Universe. Okay, for DMX Universe, the circuit number is the channel number, and the network number is the universe number. Okay, if I go up to Lightarama, the unit ID is the Lightarama unit ID, and the circuit number is the channel number. Okay, and these go up high because I happen to be here in my cactus, which is a CCD. You come up here and they look a little more familiar. Um, priority, I don't know what priority is for. Saved index, basically every single channel has a unique saved index number. Also any group that you create will have a saved index and then every RGB channel grouping of RGNB will have a saved index number and these are unique. Um, so basically from this you can play with it, format it, do whatever you want with it. Okay, So that's all it takes to uh, create a, uh, a file. Of course here you can go to save as, save to computer, sequences, right, and then you can save it as an actual Excel file. Okay, which I don't right now, but um, if you did that's how you would do it. See? Very easy to get all, all your uh, all of your channels.